emotional night for you? Just to just talk about your thoughts on what for you up there. I mean, of course, disappointing in there. Um, you know, this team fought hard. And, uh, definitely deserved better than that. I mean, the way these guys fought for 60 minutes. I mean, it wasn't the best conditions out there, and both teams, uh, you know, kind of sloppy. They were taking care of the ball, but we fought for a full 60 minutes and. Just the mistakes that we made throughout the game just came back to haunt us in the end. And you know, it's hard when it comes down to one play to decide it or whatever. But you know, that truly wasn't the deciding play. But it was disappointing, you know, for everything to finish like that. But hey, it is what it is. Kudos to Calgary. Yeah, it's that much tougher for you, just given the fact that you wanted to come back here and, and win, even forgetting what else um, was at stake. I mean, to me, that that's way down the line. I mean, number one thing was we got to get in the playoffs, and uh, that's the bottom line. And you know, for us to be able to come on the road and win against a great team like that on the road in these type of conditions you know with these guys on this team that would have been a huge momentum swing for us to give us you know some excitement uh, you know give us some confidence going forward because you know we want to, we we're trying to be that team that catches fire at the right time and tonight we had a, a great opportunity to make that happen and uh, we just let it slip through our hands it's a big big hole there's a, you're still not dead yet but they you dug yourselves a fairly big hole yeah I mean we're depending on other people right now but the bottom line is I mean if we don't take care of our own stuff come game day it doesn't matter what happens with anybody else I mean we got to figure out a way to win these last two and uh, we got a couple of Eastern teams that uh, we know very well that we've seen a lot this year. And, and uh, But it's all about how we show up. I mean, we play with a lot of energy tonight. Defense did a great job. And uh, offensively, we made some plays, but just not enough. Something to hang your head on, just the fact that you were in a position to, to win it at the end? Yeah, I mean, you know, like I said, both teams are making mistakes tonight. And, uh, you know, for us to be right there at the end, that was that definitely been a huge momentum swing for us to be able to drive down the field and, you know, put one through. Because Luca's been golden for us all year. And, you know, that was just disappointing. Point. But, but uh, again, you know, it shouldn't even came to that. I mean, we had ample opportunities to, you know, really put ourselves up, and uh, we didn't take advantage of. Henry, the end result side, what was it like playing here? Uh, it felt different. It felt different because uh, you know, coming in, you know, from in this setting, being a you know the visitor, and you know, this is still my home and everything. But uh, it was exciting as well because uh, you know, a lot of great. I have a lot of great friends in the stands. A lot of great friends on that team as well. And uh, of course, you know, this is what childhood rivalries are all about when you play each other and you give yourself bra bragging rights. And you know, definitely, uh, you know, we wanted to come in here and get a big win, number one, for the playoffs. Uh, but then again, you know, be able to win here at home would have been fulfilling as well. So, yeah, definitely would have, you know, been uh, sweet, sweet there to get a win. But. Fortunately, didn't. How tough is it going to be to bounce back from this? Uh, I mean, you know, we, we still understand we have a team coming in with Winnipeg that you know, we're, we're going to be looking forward to playing because uh, we've let a couple slip against them as well. And uh, and so, uh, yeah, I mean, it'll be disappointing. Or the first, you know, it's always disappointing we lose the first couple of days. But once we get back to work on Tuesday, guys will start to focus on Winnipeg. And we'll have a great week of practice. We'll prepare great. Because, I mean, guys play hard tonight. And uh, it was just disappointing the way things had to end. But we'll be ready to go next week.